Think before you speak. It was a sunny day, but the climate was enjoyable. Everyone in the railway station was waiting for the train to arrive. Among the crowd, there was a group of friends, youngsters who were on board for vacation. It was a busy station with juice shop, mobile restaurants, coffee and tea stalls, newspaper shop, restaurants, etc. The announcement regarding the arrival of the train was made and everyone prepared to get into the train to their appropriate places. The group of friends made loud noise to welcome the train as it entered the station. They ran to get their reserved seats before anyone could get into the train. The empty seats were filled and the train whistled to move. An old man with a young boy aged around 15 years came running to catch the train. They entered the train and the train started to move. They had their seats just adjacent to the friends group. The young boy was so surprised to see everything. He acclaimed at his father, Dad, the train is moving and the things are moving backwards. His father smiled and nodded his head. As the train started moving fast, the young boy again screamed, Dad the trees are green in color and run backward very fast. His father said, yes dear and smiled. Just like a kid, he was watching, watching everything with great enthusiasm and happiness loaded with tons of surprises. A fruit seller passed selling apples and oranges. The young boy asked his dad, I want to eat apples. His father bought him apples. He said, oh apple looks so sweet and it tastes I love this color. The group was watching all the activities of this boy and asked the boy's father is your son having any problem? Why is he behaving very differently? A friend from the group made fun of him and shouted, his son is mad I think. The father of the young boy with patience, replied to the friend group. My son was born blind. Only a few days before he was operated and got the vision. He is seeing various things in his life for the first time. The young friends became very quiet and apologized to his father and son. Think before you speak. Thanks for watching. If you like the story, let me know it in the comment and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe.